Hi, you're watching the Motorola Droid Max 2 disassembly. If you want to watch the Droid Turbo 2 disassembly, please click the link right here. All right, we have the Droid Max 2. First thing you're going to do, you're going to take the SIM tray out. Once you pop the SIM tray out, you'll take the back cover off. It's held on with clips, so you could just pop it off. Once you take it off, there are 17 T3 screws all around. Take those off one by one. All right, once you have those 17 screws out, the back cover just pops off. So that's what the inside of the back cover is. Here's your FL40 battery. All right, so you have your main camera here. You have your front-facing camera here, your earpiece, you have your bottom speaker over here, and you're gonna disconnect your battery connector over here on the bottom. You're gonna pop it up. Once you disconnect your battery connector, there's another connector over here right next to it. Pop that off. Okay, so once you got your battery connector off and you got this other connector next to it off, you're gonna pry the battery up. It has adhesive underneath it, so you can use like a, a guitar pick or a pry tool. Just get underneath it. And gently pry up so you don't bend or damage the battery. You can always heat it up just a little bit to make it a little more simple. Alright, so here's your battery. Here's your main board underneath it. Alright, so next what you're going to do, you're going to take off the plastic tape that goes over the connectors for the power and the volume buttons and also the tape that goes over the LCD connector which is up here. And once you got those removed, you're gonna open the lock for the connector for the power switch. Remove the cable from it gently so you don't tear it. And then lift the tab up also for the LCD connector cable, so it unlocks. And then once you have that unlocked, it's going to be loose. Take your front facing camera out of its socket, and then the main board is held onto the mid frame with adhesive, so just gently use your pry tool. Start off from the top right hand corner. Just get in underneath a little bit and start prying up gently. Again, you can heat this up just a little bit to make it easier.
So now you're left with the mid frame with the LCD assembly and your main board. So now we're going to go ahead and reassemble the phone. So you're going to put your LCD connector back in. And slide your board back into place. And press down firmly so the adhesive reattaches. Next, lock in the tab for your LCD connector and then reattach your power button connector in its place. Alright, once you got those back in place, put those protective stickers or the tape over it. Then you're going to put your battery back on over the motherboard. All right, once you've got your battery back on over your motherboard, you can reattach the battery cable to its connector and you can connect the connect that goes next to it as well back onto the board. And then next, you're going to put the back frame over. And you're going to put the screws back on one by one and tighten them in place. All right, once you've got all your screws back in place, all you gotta do is put your back cover back on, snap it back in place. And pop in your SIM card with your SIM tray. And power it on. You're ready to go. Thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, and comment below. And don't forget to check out the Droid Turbo 2 disassembly. The link will be right next to me.